whose rich sports history has been woven beautifully into the architecture of all World Cup stadiums. This is one of them, El Thumama Stadium, located 12 kilometers south of Doha skyline. One of the first things you would notice about this stadium is its one-of-a-kind design. The stadium's white cladding is inspired by the Gahfiya, a traditional woven cap worn for centuries by men in many Arab countries. This shared sense of tradition makes El Tumama Stadium a fitting tribute to the first FIFA World Cup in the Middle East. We're not allowed to be here. It's great. VVIP. Come. The 40,000 seats here in Al Tumano Stadium would become 20,000. Those 20,000 that would be removed, of course, would be donated to overseas countries, developing countries that will support their sporting infrastructure. Here, meanwhile, in the precinct, a multi-purpose hub will be created that would support many sports like volleyball, basketball, handball, track and field, and cycling. It's a hub that will also house some boutique hotels as well as a medical hospital. It's going to be a bustling area and the Tumama is indeed a nod to the past of Qatar. It's also a glimpse into the future of what Qatar has for tomorrow. And that about does it here at Al Tumama. I'll see you at the next stadium, all right? Whoa.